some technical difficulties. Um, this video is not a regular update. It happens to be my last video as well. Um, I'm going to be talking about more than one topic outside of what took place over recent months. I initially planned for this to be an update. I'm going to discuss parallel reality, the scientific expression, and the neighbors being a nuisance. They started a mini smearing campaign and was cold calling and all kind of stuff. So I'm going to talk about what became of that as well. Um, huh. I found while brainstorming, drafting, and editing that a rare opportunity existed for me to highlight other activities, some recent and charted and dated events as well. As you know, by now I'm being attacked by the government with some ill assorted collection of crimes that are not recognized by law. If law enforcement acknowledged the scientific crimes that are being done, it would compromise the Constitution. To give you an example of what I mean by law enforcement not recognizing the crimes that are associated with science, I'm going to use magic for an example. Magic is a phenomenon, not a delusion, a fact or situation that's observed to exist or happen. Now, if mentioned as entertainment, observers witness this show take place without sought of explanation. If mentioned as a weapon, society will openly play stupid and even insult your state of mind. So as long as the issue is kept silent, like imagine how something like that could play out in a small demographical area, a, yeah, a small geographical area. So like using the neighborhood, for an example, <laughs> using the neighborhood, for example, if something like that got out, that you know one of my claims is that you know my devices are being stolen with magic you know they'll play stupid until they can't play stupid you get what I'm saying there is it's not that the claim itself is impossible it's that the claim compromises the Constitution and these are I don't want to fast forward into all that anyhow but I'll get to that. So anyhow, they'll play stupid until they can't play stupid. And, you know, the mathematical expression behind magic is physics. The misuse of it, that's like um, distance. I think it's like time over velocity or velocity over time and distance. Like distance equals, and it's like pretty it's much five speed. Um, okay, meanwhile, magic is witchcraft. Witchcraft has been found socially acceptable by constituents or citizens. How the phenomenon is witnessed or introduced affects how the, the, the issue is perceived. That's the bottom line. How it's witnessed, how you see it being used, and how it's introduced is what affects how you will perceive the matter to be so when it's being introduced and witnessed as entertainment you know what I'm saying like motherfuckers gonna clap but when it's being used to isolate someone to make sure you don't have to deplete your funds or your resources what, what do you think is going to happen so, but outside of what do you think is going to happen, who would respond in that way? That's not a human reaction. That is not a human reaction to respond that way if someone tells you that that's being done to them. Okay, so like I was saying, like if you mention this stuff to the wrong folks, and it's crazy because... It's the profession 
It's the profession who has the wrong identity. These are covert professions. These are people who are in place. They have a covenant. They're in place to protect their interest. So keep in mind, those that fly the flag, you know, these are lovers of the flag. They benefit from the blood like they are not against but behind secret societies. And it's two sides to that, you know, like it's not like a, 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 a white thing. It's not a white thing. Um, these are those that are also Egypt or Moroccan rooted black. Is a black guy who made the white guy. And these are entities who know the basis of society structures. They overstand the unprincipled measures that are in place for them to exist, and they condone the most genetically flawed being the majority. So when, you know, and some of their more informed identities, you know, like they endorse the European way, that that's what you see in Moore's teachings. If you research Moors, that's what you're going to find in their teachings. They embrace these people and they, they, some of them even acknowledge that they made these people. So, um, so they embrace the European way, the philosophies, the teachings of created races because according to their covenant, it's understood that the white fleshly outfit was designed to be both the instrument and the fall guy. The um, their once black creator established these established these ways, um, and found these measures most conducive for the plot and plan to enslave one bloodline's pineal gland, the human model. You see the pineal gland in a lot of occult teachings, but no one ever tells you the true meaning behind it. Without enslaving the original womb woman's bloodline, nothing that Satan is make can stand or develop without handicap. So for me to be who I am, you can imagine that I'm going to have some disturbing things to tell you about your existence. In case you haven't realized right now, though, like, I'm where you get the truth. So, um, let me see. 